the blueprint will outline what is next for Singapore's connectivity infrastructure, including the broadband, mobile, and Wi-Fi networks that power our domestic connectivity, and subsea cables that provide international connectivity. The blueprint will also identify interconnections with other digital infrastructure components that complement this connectivity layer, such as data centers and digital utilities. These interconnections are vital to maximizing the value of the infrastructure stack. As Ms. Tim Paling noted, it's important that we partner with industry to chart this path. Shaping the digital connectivity blueprint alongside the government is a newly set up advisory panel on digital infrastructure that I co-chair with Mr. Irving Tan, who has rich experience in the tech sector. The development of our nationwide fiber broadband network, or NBN, is a good example of such a calculated, future-oriented bet to build digital infrastructure. As announced last year, we will be embarking on a full-scale upgrade to deliver speeds of up to 10 gigabits per second, which is 10 times faster than today. The decision to upgrade the NBN was prompted by trends towards more content generation by end users and immersive interactions between users in the digital space. These have the potential to transform sectors such as education and entertainment. We want to ensure that our infrastructure can support such bandwidth, intense, such bandwidth intensive activities. This is a significant endeavor on a nationwide scale. It is important that we undertake it efficiently and in close partnership with industry. Industry players generally recognize these trends, the bandwidth requirements they bring, and the importance of planning ahead for our NBN infrastructure. MCI and the advisory panel will continue to engage the wider industry on the upgrade approach and consider their feedback as we chart our way forward.